I'm Lauren with Dixieville Paint Company and today I'm going to show you how to use the product Crackle. Crackle is really cool to use on your project pieces if you want to give it an old and weathered look. So I've painted my planter with two coats of slick stick. That's because it had a high gloss surface so the slick stick is perfect for that. I selected the color Serenity from the Dixie Bell Silk line to give it this beautiful blue shade. And don't worry if your Serenity isn't 100% covering the planter because when I show you how the Crackle works with the ultimate color over the top of Anchor, the Serenity is going to peek through on the cracks and it's going to look really cool. When using Crackle, you want to make sure to never shake your product. You're actually going to stir it like so. It's ready to pour into a separate container now. I'm using my Dixie Belle mini brush to apply my first and only coat of the Crackle. Our first and only coat of the Crackle paint has completely dried. Now I'm ready to paint with Anchor over the Crackle. It's important to note that when you're painting over Crackle, you want your brush to go in one direction. No back brushing, it'll disturb the Crackle effect. Make sure to get full coverage with your first coat because you cannot go back and do a second coat. This piece is complete. I've transformed this cheap planter in this super cool weathered crackle look. I used two coats of slick stick and then I did one coat of the silk all-in-one serenity. I loved that color. I covered one coat of crackle over that and then I did the anchor silk all-in-one paint over that to achieve this look.